What is up guys? I'm given the chance to be able to showcase a lot of local talent and local filmmakers that are trying to break out into the industry and show off what they're made of. And I'm able to do that today with the Replacement Trilogy. Let's jump into it. The Replacement Trilogy is directed by Madison Eastley and stars Ryan McDonald and is a three-part story revolving around this main character who is living in a dystopian future, much like a dystopian Mad Max type of future where technology is still around. He's a lone survivor kind of going through this desert plain when he comes across people that are trying to harm him and some townsfolk that need his help. And that's about as in-depth as I'd like to get for this trilogy because it is a pretty short trilogy and I really want you guys to go and check it out and tell me what you think of it for yourselves. What I really love about this movie is the tone. First of all, it does have a really great tone, much like Mad Max or even perhaps Looper. As well, there are a lot of action scenes in these films and I like to think that that's probably the best part of these films is the way these action films are shot kind of in a handheld form, much like the Bourne Identity, but you're still engaged. The framing is fine so it doesn't look like it's just shaking all over. You never feel lost in the action when they're doing the close-up shots. It always looks clean. If there are any criticisms I really had with the films, I would say that part one and part two really could be combined to be its own thing. The first part of the replacement trilogy is about a minute and 45 second runtime, and I just don't think that it really engages me enough to feel invested when I go into the second one. If those two were more combined, or maybe there was a way to sew in all three of these, I think it would have better pacing. As well, there were some dialogue scenes where it felt a little bit too on the nose. Some of the lines and the delivery of those lines really felt like it was coming from a lot of influence from Mad Max. And I think this film has so much potential to be its own thing. It has a really unique tone. It's essentially Looper meets Mad Max and that's a really awesome combination to see. Overall, I really had a good time with the Replacement Trilogy. Guys, go and check this out. I'll leave a link in the description down below. I'm going to give the Replacement Trilogy a 7 out of 10. Madison, thank you again for letting me do these reviews to be able to check them out and refer them to people. So guys, tell me what you thought of the Replacement Trilogy. Whatever you thought, leave a comment down below. Stay tuned for the Mummy review that is coming very soon, as well as a collaboration review I have going with Jack's channel of stuff. You can check his channel out in the description as well. Thank you again as always for watching, and I will see you at the next review.